Hey guys, Mitch with Shock Therapy, and today we're gonna to be showing you how to install the front link kit on the Polaris Pro XP. This link kit's gonna do a couple of different things for you guys. Not only do they look really good, they also add strength and rigidity throughout the cornering or when you're mobbing through the desert. This link kit is made in our very own in-house CNC machine shop and uses the strongest 5 8 rod ends on the market. This install should take you no longer than an hour, so let's jump on in. I'm gonna show you guys how to install it. The first step in the installation is to remove the factory link. This is done by using an 18 millimeter wrench and an 18 millimeter socket. Remove the nut, followed by the bolt going through the sway bar link and the sway bar itself. Next, remove the upper hardware holding the sway bar link to the factory control arm. This is also done by using an 18 millimeter wrench and an 18 millimeter socket. To speed up the process, you can also use an electric impact to remove the hardware. Remove the nut, followed by the bolt, and remove the sway bar link from the factory control arm. With both the factory links removed, you can now take the shock therapy link and clock the rod ends in the correct orientation, install them into a vise, and lock down the jam nuts. With the new shock therapy link tightened and clocked, you can now install it back into the factory location on the upper control arm. Keep in mind that all of the misalignment spacers are exactly the same so they do not matter where they go. Insert the bolt through the factory control arm, followed by the nut on the back side. Next, install the lower bolt that goes through the sway bar, through the link, followed by the nut on the back side. Repeat these steps on the opposite side. Starting with the passenger side lower hardware first, make sure that you tighten down and torque all of the hardware to 88 foot-pounds. Next tighten all of the factory upper hardware, making sure that you torque the hardware to 88 foot-pounds. Repeat these steps on the opposite side and your installation is complete. We hope that this video helped you guys with the installation of your front link kit at home on the Polaris Pro XP. One thing to keep in mind is after the first 100 to 300 miles, make sure that you check the jam nuts to ensure that they are still tight. Another thing to keep in mind is that the rod ends in this link kit are considered wearing items. Now, the link body is threaded in case the rod ends ever do wear out, simply unthread them and replace them with new ones. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel and hit the bell to be notified anytime that we post a new video. If you'd like to order this link kit or any other products that we offer, feel free to visit the website at www.shocktherapyusa.com. For any technical assistance or any other questions, give the shop a call at 623-217-4959. Josh, make sure it's in loose. Make sure it's loosening it, not tightening it. Next. I, dude, these things with me like hard. If you like this video, be sure, make sure you do it. <laughs>